practice has been um, great so far. We're focusing on, you know, staying tough when it's cold outside and um, just working really hard, working on the basics and building up from there. I think it's a great opportunity here. I think that the school um, has a lot of really positive qualities about it and the athletics is really up and coming, especially the women's lacrosse team. Um, I think the first couple weeks, a little bit of a process and us getting to know each other a little better and their playing styles, my coaching styles, mixing and matching a little bit. Um, but it, it really uh, boils down to a lot of conversations with my leaders um, and that's really is what helps us, um, you know, just take the program to the next level and also, everyone be on the same page. Uh, this senior class is, is uh, so special because we started the program. So it's like we've just grown up so much and we've grown up together. So we've we've had our back, each other's backs the entire four years here. We started this program. So we've been by each other's side from the day we got here and we'll be by each other's side till the day we leave. And we have grown so much together as a team and like as friends like off the field. Last year's season is definitely motivation for this year. Um, we are looking to improve obviously and you know beat the teams that we've never beat and um, make it further into playoffs just I mean focusing on us and improving where we know we could do better. Our schedule is the toughest it's ever been and we do that on purpose, right? So we do that, we put teams in our schedule and in our non-conference games to prepare us for the NE10. And I think that this year going down to Florida, playing Florida Tech is a huge advantage and will definitely help us prepare for the Adelphi's and Lemoines and you know those kind of teams. But we talk about it on a daily basis, right? And th those teams are kind of our, our goal and you know, I think it's definitely possible for us and um, we kind of are believing in, in our kids right now and the girls in the team to really have the courage and, and be brave enough to just go after it and kind of beat those teams and surprise a lot of teams and I think that they have kind of really bought into that.